Okay, we are back again. This time it's a, a different type of question. It's not a multiple choice. We're talking about a Bombardier Beetle. And there's the question. We are given um, these equations as per normal. I want to label each one. So there's one, two, three, and four. Remember, we're, we're trying to achieve, it's saying calculate the enthalpy change right we're trying to achieve the equation given so again i want to write out these equations and manipulate them in such a way that it balances out numerically to give us the equation in number four so immediately when i look at this i look at the first equation number one and i see that i have two components in the correct reactant and product position so I'm looking let me circle this here and here here and here so that's a good start so let me write that down first component so that's four then the hydroxide here we are okay this is a good start now we know this value is plus 177.0 kilojoules okay now let's look at equation number two as you can see we have this water molecule there this on the opposite side now if I was to flip this around that would satisfy us having two moles of water. But I have to look at the hydrogen peroxide as well. It's where it gets slightly more complicated, but nothing we can't handle. Okay, look at this hydrogen peroxide. And if you look over here, there's one mole required. So the first thing I want to do without putting any moles in is flip this. So... I'm just simply flipping this equation and without adding any coefficients. So, O2. Now, I need one mole of hydrogen peroxide, H2O2. So, I'm going to divide everything by 2 to get that one mole. So, if I divide that by 2, that stays as one mole of hydrogen peroxide, one mole of water, and half a mole of oxygen so what have I done I flip this okay so now it's become negative 189.2 but I've also divided by 2 so number 3 if I look at number 3 now and look at the original equation I need water molecules on the product side so I have to flip this again so let's flip this. So we've got half oxygen plus H2, right? And um, I have the product would be H2O. Now, I've just flipped this around and as I look at numbers, I don't need to add any coefficient or any multiple so this will become minus 285.5 now obviously the units are the same now one thing I noticed which I didn't do I didn't account for this it doesn't make a difference to us to add it in now so always account for everything now what I need to do is let's change color so this becomes a bit more obvious what can I eliminate? Okay, so I can eliminate hydrogen from both sides. Okay, is there anything else I can eliminate? I can eliminate the oxygen. Okay, now if I add things up and I have C6H4. O H two plus H two 
O2. And the products are, we've got two moles of water here, one on each side. We're going to add them up, but let's get the uh, C6H4O2 on there first, plus the two moles of water, which gives us 2H2O. Now, this equation is what we require here. So we've done all our manipulating. Now, it's about the mathematics. We use our calculator. So we would then do plus 177.0 plus, add open brackets here, minus 189.2 divided by 2 plus, and open brackets again, minus 285. Now this will equal, let's, I'm going to do this on my calculator right now, so plus, so 177 plus, I'm opening brackets, minus 189.2 divided by 2, and I'm closing my brackets, then plus, open brackets, minus 285.5, I'm going to close the bracket, and this gives me a grand answer of minus 203.1, let's not forget the units, right, there's my answer, now let me check if this is right, awesome, okay guys, and that's another one done, well done, to those who followed that through, anything, just put it on the comments, the questions, or anything regarding that, and I'll see you later.